Dogecoin, the meme cryptocurrency made famous by a smiling Shiba Inu, reached its highest level since 2021 on Thursday. This rise is part of a broader trend moving away from traditional finance sectors. Take the S&P 500, for example. It's tipped record highs 17 times this year and what will likely be the best first quarter gain since 2019. In a recent interview with Bloomberg, Bank of America's chief investment strategist, Michael Hartnett, raised concerns about a potential market bubble. He specifically pointed out the exceptional gains in tech stocks, referred to as the Magnificent Seven, as indicative of this bubble within the booming bull market. But Michael, so first of all, there is a bubble. Right. You're, well, you're, are you seeing a bubble? There's, there's characteristics of a bubble. Right. It would make sense. In what? The Magnificent Seven? Yes. And, and AI-related stocks and, you know, you can see a little bit of it in crypto as well. I mean, there's no. tremendous euphoria. The euphoria yes. is there because Absolutely. of the Fed. The Fed wants to cut rates, no. come what may, you know, and, and the markets are front-running that in gold, in crypto, no. in equities, even no. in corporate bonds. But a bubble, you know, is when too much money chases too few goods and everyone wants chips and there's a lot of money sort of chasing that. And yeah, I think it has characteristics in terms of price, the speed of the movement, the valuation, the breadth, you know, bubbles are yeah. narrow, bull markets are broad, and this isn't very broad. In turn, the crypto sector, particularly Bitcoin ETFs, has caught investors' attention. This year's approval of Bitcoin ETFs fueled a significant market rally, pushing its market cap to more than $1.4 trillion, and big companies are taking note. BlackRock and Fidelity have seen significant investor interest in their ETFs, drawing nearly $8 billion. And at the time of this recording, Bitcoin is trading at $71,000.